As you guys should know, I am a student at Williamsburg, and this is a straw tower challenge. So let's get straight into it. Let me So I have gotten into montages recently, so what I thought I would do is do exactly that and show all of my different tests and structures I did make in this process before the final structure. So I hope you guys did enjoy that montage I gave you for the different tests and structures I used for this assignment. Now, for the final product itself, we managed to go ahead and use 32 straws, which are 8 straws below the limit of... Um, the 40 straws that we're supposed to use so that's good and uh, we used 21 clips and we only could use 30 so we got that good and uh, also with the tape we could only use 24 inches or two feet and we used 20 inches so we had it so that we didn't go over the limits of this. Now, we're going to put our can of soda on the top of here for at least eight seconds. Here we go. So we have this here, and this is a total of 20 inches tall. Now that is a great accomplishment in my opinion. Now, for the base and the suspension of the bottom layer, also the top layer. Uh, so, we have triangles and squares for a good structure so it wouldn't fall apart because triangles really do help it will really make the structure stronger and also we have a teepee here for the top layer and it uh, goes in and basically it uh, evenly uh, puts the weight across the whole structure so there's not weight in one place of it. Now uh, inside Sorry, not inside, but uh, the way we got the can of soda to get on top of here, we have it so these straws go around this part of the soda can so it could stand like this so it wouldn't fall over. And for proof that uh, this isn't an empty can of soda and it is indeed full, haven't opened it, and also if you hear closely, it's still full, and it is not empty. Now, we use the tapes and paper clips to uh, put the straws together so they wouldn't go like outside and go flimsy on us. <laughs> um, so we have, if you can look closely here, we have the paper clips going inside the straws, and they're connected. Also, with the tape support right here, if you can see. Also, how we got these triangles to go through, or an X if you see that. We wrapped a paper clip around here, so this wouldn't like go forward or backwards 
uh, and it just gives you some more support. Also, that's good. <laughs> you can push down and it's a really supported structure. Also, uh, there's also the uh, support in these straws because we have internal straws, as you can see here, we put bendy straws through here and we made it so that these go up through here and then we put the regular straws through and down them and it gives it that extra layer to support the can of soda. Now I'm just going to put this back on just because and let's just see how it works. Let's get this in here. There we go. Got it. Oh, why isn't it working anymore? Eh. Okay. <laughs> so, okay. <laughs> whatever and uh, yeah that's gonna be it for the structure that we made I hope you guys did learn something from this or just had fun watching uh, but that's going to be it for my assignment I just want to thank Williamsburg for me for assigning this to me because it was really fun to do but that's gonna be it for today's video and I will see you later bye